was only one chief. One? Are you sure? Yes. They called it the Pillar of Autumn. Why was it not destroyed with the rest of their fleet? It fled as we set fire to their planet. But I followed with all the ships in my command. When you first saw Halo, were you blinded by its majesty? Blinded? Paralyzed? Dumbstruck? No. Yet the humans were able to evade your ships, land on the sacred ring, and desecrate it with their filthy footsteps. Noble hierarchs, surely you understand that once the parasite attacked... There will be order in this council! You were right to focus your attention on the Flood. But this demon, this Master Chief... By the time I learned the demon's intent... There was nothing I could do. Noble Prophet of Truth, this has gone on long enough. Make an example of this bundler. The Council demands it. You are one of our most treasured instruments. Long have you led your fleet with honor and distinction. But your inability to safeguard Halo was a colossal failure. Hey, it was heresy! I will continue my campaign against the humans. No, you will not. Soon the great journey shall begin, but when it does, the weight of your heresy will stay your feet, and you shall be left behind. was about to fail. There's viscosity throughout the gel layer. Optics, totally fried. And let's not even talk about the power supply. You know how expensive this gear is, son? Tell that to the Covenant. I guess it was all obsolete anyway. Your new suit's a Mark VI. Just came up from Songnam this morning. Try and take it easy until you get used to the upgrades. Okay, let's test your targeting first thing. Please look at the top light. Good. Now look at the bottom light. All right, look at the top light again. That's it. Now the bottom one. Okay. Tracking looks sketchy. I'm gonna run you through the full diagnostic. The diagnostic software sets your targeting system to be normal. Go ahead and look at each of the four lights, Chief. You want me to leave it like that or make it inverted? I'll leave your targeting set to normal. If you change your mind, you can switch the setting anytime. Stand by. I'm gonna offline the inhibitors. Move around a little. Get a feel for it. When you're ready, come meet me by the zapper. Pay attention, because I'm only going over this once. This station will test your recharging energy shields. Step on in, I'll show you. Your new armor shields are extremely resilient, very efficient. Bingo! As you can see, they recharge a lot faster. If your shields go down, find some cover, wait for the meter to read fully charged. That, or he can hide behind me. You done with my boy here, Master Guns? I don't see any training wheels. His armor's working fine, Johnson. You're free to go, son. Just remember, take things slow. Don't worry. I'll hold his hand. So, Johnson, when you gonna tell me how you made it back home in one piece? Sorry, Guns. It's classified. Huh! <laughs> my ass! Well, you can forget about those adjustments to your A2 scope. Well, he's in a particularly fine mood. Maybe Lord Hood didn't give him an invitation. Uh, 
Earth. <laughs> Haven't seen it in years. When I shipped out for basic, the orbital defense grid was all theory and politics. Now look, the Cairo is just one of 300 geosync platforms. That Mac gun can put a round clean through a Covenant capital ship. Coordinated fire from the Athens and the Malta, nothing's getting past this battle cluster in one piece. Ships have been arriving all morning. Nobody's saying much, but I'll bet something big's about to happen. You told me you were gonna wear something nice. Folks need heroes, Chief, to give them hope. So smile, would ya? Well, we still got something to smile about. Another whisper, sir, near Io. We have probes en route. Uh, I apologize, but we're going to have to make this quick. You look nice. Thank you. Sergeant Major, the Colonial Cross is awarded for acts of singular daring and devotion. For a soldier of the United Earth Space Corps... There can be no greater heresy. Let him be an example for all who would break our covenant. Commander Miranda Keyes, your father's actions were in keeping with the highest traditions of military service. His bravery in the face of impossible odds reflects great credit upon himself and the UNSC. The Navy has lost one of its best. directly off our battle cluster. Show me. Fifteen Covenant Capital ships holding position just outside the kill zone. This is Fleet Admiral Harper. We are engaging the enemy. Negative, Admiral. Form a defensive perimeter around the cluster. Commander, get to your ship. Link up with the fleet. Yes, sir. You have the Mac gun, Cortana. As soon as they come in range, open up. Gladly. Something's not right. The fleet that destroyed Reach was 50 times this size. Sir, additional contacts. Boarding craft and lots of them. They're going to try to take our Mac guns offline. Give their capital ships a straight shot at Earth. Master Chief, defend this station. Yes, sir. I need a weapon. Right this way.
Report to battle station. How's it going, Malta? Stand by. They're latched. Check your targets, watch the crossfire. They're in standard formation. Little bastards up front, big ones in back. Good luck, Cairo.
moving up its borders. Malta, what is your status? Over. I don't believe it! They're retreating! We won! They're leaving the Athens. Cortana, assessment. That explosion came from inside the Athens. Same as the Malta. The Covenant must have brought something with them. A bomb. Then they sure as hell brought one here. Chief, find it. Combat personnel to Christmas. Get the hell out of my armory, split lift! Pursuant to Office of Oni Retrieval and Acquisitions Inquiry of 26 September 2552, the following is a target profile of Thel Vadami, Supreme Commander of the Covenant Fleet of Particular Justice compiled by Lieutenant Commander Locke. First confirmed contact with Vadami came in 2535 on an unofficial human colony known as the Rubble. After action reports from civilians, as well as Spartan Units 006, 111, and 120, suggest that Vatami was at that point a relatively minor functionary of the Prophet of Regret. Spartan 006 engaged Vatami in combat on the run. Both parties survived the encounter.
Shortly after 2535, the UNSC first encountered the newly formed Covenant Fleet of Particular Justice, now led by Vatican. Review of early engagements with this fleet show that it quickly grew in size from five to nearly 60 ships as Vatimi cut a path in many human systems. Only Section 3 made multiple attempts to anticipate or even track Vatimi's movements at the cost of a number of operative lives. Vatimi eluded all such efforts and he continued his unpredictable and devastating campaign. Vatimi also stands out from other Covenant commanders in the frequency in which he takes a personal role in ground assaults. Fire Control Center. They have a bomb. Can you defuse it? Yes, but I'll need the Chief's help to make contact with the detonator. Chief, get to the bomb, double time. Cortana, prioritize targets and fire at will. First echelon, you're with me. Blanket those cruisers. Take them out one by one. Second echelon, keep those carriers busy. Registering all hostile vessels inside the kill zone. Thirteen cruisers. I'm going loud. carrier. Admiral, do what you can against the second. Everyone, form up! Follow my lead! The first carrier completely ignored us, sir. Blew through the Malta's debris field and headed straight for Earth.
so you know, there are quite a few elites guarding the bomb. You may need to get creative. You don't want to know. Cairo, this is an Emberclad. The carrier shield is down. I'm in position and ready for immediate assault. Negative, Commander. Not against a ship that size. Not on your own. Sir, permission to leave the station. For what purpose, Master Chief? To give the Covenant back their bomb. Permission granted. I know what you're thinking, and it's crazy. So, stay here. Unfortunately for us both, I like crazy. Just one question. What if you miss? I won't. Gear up. We're taking this fight to the surface. Any idea what it means? Dear humanity, we regret being alien bastards. We regret coming to Earth. And we most definitely regret the Corps just blew up our raggedy ass fleet. Hoorah! Regret is a name, Sergeant. The name of one of the Covenant's religious leaders, a prophet. He's on that carrier and he's calling for help. <laughs> Immediate. Grid Kilo 23 is hot. Recommend mission abort. Roger, Recon. It's your call, Sarge. We're going in. Get tactical, Marines! Mr. Chief, get aboard that carrier. Secure the Prophet of Regret. This is the only place on Earth the Covenant decided to land. That Prophet is going to tell us why. Whoa. Shake it off, Marines! 
Clear the crash site. Go, go, go.
barrel's a little big for that courtyard, Sergeant. I see a good LZ on the other side of these buildings. Meet you there. Over. Copy that. Come and get a satchel on the gate. on that bird. Yeah. My pelicans are going to start airlifting armor and reinforcements into the city. They'll need an escort that isn't afraid of a little hostile ground fire. Sites on the other side of this hotel, Chief. Covenant are crawling all over it. Follow me. Stay out of sight. Get back! 
concentration of Covenant troops is directly below the carrier. I don't think they want you to get on board. That bridge is the most direct route to the city center. Tactical chatter. We're surprised. Ooh, I don't think they expected us to be here. Not you and me. All of us. Humanity on Earth. Odd, I know, but it does help explain why they came here with such a small fleet. Take that home to your mother! Better keep up! Don't let them.
mercy of Platoon. Wasted, Sarge. And we will be too, sir, if we don't get the hell out of here. You hit Marine. N no, sir. Then listen up. You had your chance to be afraid before you joined my beloved corps. But to guide you back to the true path, I brought this motivational device. Our big green style cannot be defeated. What about that scarab? We've all run the simulations. They're tough, but they ain't invincible. Stay with the Master G. You'll know what to do. Yes, sir, Sergeant. Thanks for the tank. He never gets me anything. Oh, I know what the ladies like.
headquarters on the other side, sir. Use this.
Perez, A Company, CP's this way. Push on through! The lieutenant got hit as soon as we dropped in. Who's in charge now, Corporal? Nina, Mars Tiggs, Sergeant Banks. When I asked for reinforcements, I didn't think they'd send us part. We got trouble.
Chief and return to you in Amberclad. Roger that. Status. Sir, the Prophet is bugging out. Request permission to engage. Negative, Commander. All Vector 2 heavies for star side intercept. Bam! Flip space rupture off the target's bow. It's going to jump inside the city. There's no time, sir. Green light. Green light to engage. Punch it. Get us close. Destination solution. We are not losing that ship. Something special in mind. And take your brutes with you. Release the prisoner. The Council decided to have you hung by your entrails and your corpse paraded through the city. But ultimately, the terms of your execution are up to me. I am already dead. Indeed. Do you know where we are? The mausoleum of the Arbiter. Quite so. Here rests the vanguard of the great journey. Every arbiter from first to last. Each one created and consumed in times of extraordinary crisis. The taming of the hunters, the Grunt Rebellion. Were it not for the arbiters, the Covenant would have broken long ago. Even on my knees, I do not belong in their presence. Halo's destruction was your error, and you rightly bear the blame. But the Council was overzealous. We know you are no heretic. This is the true face of heresy. One who would subvert our faith and incite rebellion against the High Council. Our prophets are false. Open your eyes, my brothers. They will use the faith of our forefathers to bring ruin to us all. The great journey is... This heretic, and those who follow him, must be silenced. Their slander offends all who walk the path. What use am I? I can no longer command ships, lead troops into battle. Not as you are, no. But become the Arbiter. And you shall be set loose against this heresy with our blessing. What of the Council? The tasks you must undertake as the Arbiter are perilous, suicidal. You will die as each Arbiter has before you. The Council will have their corpse.
What would you have your Arbiter do? When we joined the Covenant, we took an oath. According to our station, all without exception. On the blood of our fathers, on the blood of our sons, we swore to uphold the Covenant. Even to our dying breath. Those who would break this oath are heretics. Worthy of neither pity nor mercy. Even now, they use our Lord's creations to broadcast their lives. We shall grind them into dust and continue our march to glorious salvation. This armor suits you, but it cannot hide that mark. Nothing ever will. You are the Arbiter, the will of the Prophets. But these are my elites. Their lives matter to me, yours does not. That makes two of us. Hmm. Later, there is no doubt the storm will strike the facility. We'll be long gone before it arrives. Engage active camouflage. Reveal yourselves only after the Arbiter has joined battle with the enemy. You may wish to do the same, Arbiter. But take heed. Your armor system is not as new as ours. Your camouflage will not last forever.
Protect your target, Arbiter. Ah! My brothers, I will defend the Oracle. It truth must stop me, my Mobilizing their air forces, officer. Get after their leader, but watch your back. I'm sending one of our bandits to support you.
sign of the heretic leader or his banshee. We must keep searching. What is it? That stench. I've smelled it before. Come out, so we may kill you. <laughs> Get in line. Later. Stand firm. The flood is gone. Not 
See? Heretic fools! What have they done? Go, Arbiter. I'll follow when I reinforce them.
you come along, take care. Enemy in sight.
Whoever's about to hit. We cannot maintain our position. Bring the Phantoms close to the mine. You're not leaving until the leader of the territory. Save me from the storm, but you will be consumed. Arbiter, where is he? Stinking floodbait boxed himself in tight. We'll never break through this. Then we shall force him out. How? The cable. I'm going to cut it. Get everyone back to the ships. Warriors, return to the landing zone. The Arbiter will continue upward, cut this station loose, and scare, scare the heretic from his hold.
die by your hand than let the prophets lead me to slaughter. Who has taught you these lies? The Oracle. Hello. I am 343 Guilty Spark. I am the monitor of Installation 04. Ask the Oracle about Halo. How they would sacrifice us all for nothing. More questions? Splendid. I would be happy to assist you. It's a blind arbiter, but I will make them see. Key the system. Do it and find out where we are. Sorry for the quick jump, Sergeant. You in one piece? I'm good. Yeah. Chief? We're fine. Ma'am, there's an object coming into view now. Cortana, what exactly am I looking at? That is another halo. <laughs> Say what? So this is what my father found. I thought Halo was some sort of super weapon. It is. If activated, this ring will cause destruction on a galactic scale. I want all the information you've got on the first Halo. Schematic, topography, whatever. I don't care if I have the clearance or not. Yes, ma'am. Where's our target? The enemy ship has stopped above the ring, ma'am. We're going to pass right over it. Perfect. Given what we know about this ring, it's even more important that we capture the Prophet of Regret. Find out why he came to Earth. Why he came here. Chief, take first platoon. Hard drop. Secure landing zone. Sergeant, load up two flights of pelicans and follow them in. Aye, aye, ma'am. Until I can move and fight, I'm going to keep a low profile. Once you leave the ship, you're on your own. Understood. Over the target, in five. Hang on to your helmet. Could we possibly make 
any more noise? I guess so. We've got to neutralize those turrets. until the pelican arrives, Chief. Let's wait for our warthog, unless you really want to walk.
Here comes our ride. I got a good view coming in. There's a big building in the middle of this island's lake. I saw it too. It looked like a temple. If I were a megalomaniac, and I'm not, that's where I'd be. Regarding the history of the Covenant and its glorious founding species, the San Shayum and Sanghili, the record of punished deeds would not be sufficient without a word on the Arbiter. Not the consignment of shame that it is currently, but what came before, the legendary warriors of Sanghili past. Before the Covenant, the Sanghili ruled their world with pride and vigilance, surviving the perils of both land and sea. These were the arbiters of old, part king, part judge, warrior rulers, unlike any of which would follow. When we arrived on their frontier world of Olgathon, the cost of life was severe. Led by a mighty arbiter, the Sanghili resisted our entreatment with ruthless force, leading to decades of war. We would eventually triumph, of course. And when we did, we would not ignore the mantle of the arbiter. Like all things, we would bend the Sanghili to our own ends. The Arbiters would become the very will of the Prophets. Now about those rakes. 
Roger that. Armor's on the way.
do. Hey, mind if I use that one? No problem, Chief. You drive. Pull over, Chief. I'm gonna be sick. Hey, don't worry. Appreciate you shooting that turret. That was helpful. Ah, this never gets old, mate. up in the middle of this structure. We need to clear them out. Chief. I lost it.
always bring me to such nice places. Still no word about in amber clad on the Covenant battle net. It's odd. The Covenant know we made landfall, but they don't seem to consider us a very serious threat. Boy, are they in for a big surprise. Watch yourself! Honor Guard! Watch yourself, honor guards. Death for you. Demon! Go back. That's what I thought he said. The Prophet of Regret is planning to activate Halo. Are you sure? I shall light this holy ring, release its cleansing flame, and burn a path into the divine beyond! Pretty much. Commander, we've got a problem. So I hear. But from what I understand, the Prophet will need an object, the Index, to activate the ring. I've located a library similar to the one you found on the first Halo. If the rings work the same way, the Index should be inside. I'll bet the Covenant are thinking the exact same thing. Then we better beat them to it, Sergeant. Extract your men and meet me at the library. Yes, ma'am. I'll secure the Index, Chief. You take out the Prophet. He's given us all the intel we need.
You fellas better keep up! Cortana, the Covenant's getting nosy. I don't want to give away my position, so I'm rerouting a few stragglers back to you. I apologize. These Pelicans are all the support you're going to get. Understood, ma'am. is launching from the far towers. Big surprise, it's full of Covenant reinforcements. Good rounds for good men. 
This light couldn't have been formed by volcanic action, which means it was either built this way on purpose or was created by some other cataclysmic event. Sorry, were you trying to kill something? I can't see it! What was that? connects these towers to the outlying structures. Looks like we're going down. Unless you'd prefer to swim. Full car coming up! I've intercepted a secure transmission from Regret's carrier to something called High Charity. It seems to be a formal apology to the prophets of truth and mercy. Apparently, Regret jumped the gun when he attacked Earth. He's asking the other prophets to forgive his premature arrival, arguing that no human presence was foretold. That explains why there were so few ships in his fleet. But it's odd a prophet would have such bad intel about his enemy's homeworld. 
Don't say much, do you, sir? Regret's carrier just received a response from High Charity. A very well-encrypted message from the Prophet of Truth. Listen to this. Your haste has jeopardized the fulfillment of our covenant, threatened our grand design. That you shall be spared a public display of our contempt is thanks only to mercy and his wise counsel. Truth 
Mercy, regret. Three prophet hierarchs. Killing regret should shake up the covenant leadership. But frankly, it sounds like you might be doing truth a favor. I'm nearly out of fuel. We've secured the first tower cluster, so I'll set down there. Call when you're ready for evac. Going, you two. So far, so good. We're approaching the main temple now. Roger that. I'm as close to the library as I can get. There's some sort of barrier. We're trying to find a way around it. I'll keep you posted.
That's the largest Covenant fleet I've ever seen. The largest anyone's ever seen. Get inside the temple and kill Regret before it can stop us. fleet has launched multiple waves of phantoms. Too many for me to track. We don't have much time. It's not him. Uh, 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 our honor guards are all over this place. Watch your back. Target, take him out. The phantoms are turning around. The fleet is preparing to fire on our position. We need to get out of here. His murderer was within our grasp. If you had not withdrawn our phantoms... Are you questioning my decision? No, Holy One. I only wish to express my concern that the brutes... Recommissioning the Guard was a radical step. But recent events have made it abundantly clear that the Elites can no longer guarantee our safety. I shall relay your decision to the Council. Do you know, Arbiter, the Elites have threatened to resign, to quit the High Council, because of this exchange of hats? 
We have always been your protectors. These are trying times for all of us. Even as the human's annihilation filled us with satisfaction, the loss of one of the sacred rings racked our hearts with grief. Putting aside our sorrow, we renewed our faith in the prophecy that other rings would be found and see how our faith has been rewarded. Halo! Its divine wind will rush through the stars, propelling all who are worthy along the path to salvation. But how to start this process? For ages we searched for one who might unlock the secrets of the rings. An oracle. And with your help we found it. With appropriate humility, we plied the Oracle with questions, and it, with clarity and grace, has shown us the key. You will journey to the surface of the ring and retrieve this sacred icon. With it, we shall fulfill our promise. Salvation for all! And begin the great journey. Once the shield is down, We'll head straight to the library. I do not wish to keep the Hierarchs waiting. The human that killed the Prophet of Regret. Who was it? Who do you think? The demon is here? <laughs> Why? Looking for a little payback? Retrieving the Icon is my only concern. <laughs> of course.
power source arbiter. Overload the locks holding it in place. It's useless to attack an enforcer from the front, especially when their shields are up. They in the shadows, weaken it loses interest. Then strike the beast when its back is turned.
Professor is an impressive killer. This zone is a sacred icon critical to the great journey. I must find it. We shall cut into the heart of this infestation, retrieve the icon, and burn any flood that stands in our way. The parasite is not to be trifled with. I hope you know what you're doing. Forward, warriors, and fear not pain or death. Go, officer. I'll follow when our reinforcements arrive.
It is most unusual that in all the exploits of these Arbiters, you never mention their role in choosing their missions of redemption. There is no role, Oracle. Once one of our commanders becomes an Arbiter, he belongs to the Hierarchs. These Hierarchs, they are the same High Prophets who control all the holy relics you collect from my time? The same. And they use these relics to build your new weapons and bring you the word of your gods? It has always been so. Interesting. Am I a holy relic? I... I do not understand. Because I am certainly not a god. I am a tool, as is this mining platform you stand upon, as was the installation that once orbited the planet. The Forerunner's technology is lasting and indeed quite powerful, but I'm quite certain they would have told me if I was infused with some kind of divine power. I suspect some of your prophets may have been quite aware of how much divine inspiration tools such as myself could provide. And you never question these proclamations. Even your mightiest warriors, these Arbiters, never question? Questioning was what brought shame to the word Arbiter long ago, Oracle. How disappointing. I fear now that there are many questions we should have been asking for a long, long time. I would be more than happy to answer any such questions, but I have a few more for you. Continue your tale of these Arbiters.
More humans. They must be after the icon. On your way, Arbiter. I'll deal with these beasts. the way, Arbiter. Come <laughs> on. 
You know, your father never asked me for help either. The index is secure. Mackenzie, Perez, how's our exit? You hear me, Marines? We got trouble. learn of this, but they will take your head when they learn. <laughs> Fool. They ordered me to do it. this thing off. Demon. This one is machine and nerve, and has its mind concluded. This one is but flesh and faith, and is the more deluded. Kill me or release me, Parasite. But do not waste my time with talk. There is much talk, and I have listened through rock and metal and time. Now I shall talk, and you shall listen. Greetings. I am 2401 Penitent Tangent. I am the monitor of Installation 05. And I am the Prophet of Regret, Council of Most High, Hierarch of the Covenant. A reclaimer? Here? At last. We have much to do. This facility must be activated if we are to control this outbreak. Stay where you are. Nothing can be done until my sermon is complete. Not true. This installation has a successful utilization record of 1.2 trillion simulated in one actual. It is ready to fire on demand. Of all the objects our lords left behind, there are none so worthless as these oracles. They know nothing of the great journey! And you know nothing about containment. You have demonstrated complete disregard for even the most basic protocols. This one's containment. And this one's great journey are the same. Your prophets have promised you freedom from a doomed existence. But you will find no salvation on this ring. Those who built this place knew what they wrought. Do not mistake their intent, or all will perish as they did before. This thing is right. Halo is a weapon. Your prophets are making a big mistake. 
Your ignorance already destroyed one of the sacred rings, demon. It shall not harm another. If you will not hear the truth, then I will show it to you. There is still time to stop the key from turning. But first it must be found. You will search one likely spot. And you will search another. Fate hath us meet as foes. But this ring will make us brothers. Gravely concerned. The release of the parasite was unexpected, unfortunate, but there is no need to panic. In truth, this is a time to rejoice. A moment that all the Covenant should savor. For the sacred icon has been found. With it, our path is clear, our entry into the divine beyond guaranteed. The great journey is nigh, and nothing, not even the flood, can stop it. Kill the demon! Brutes! The faster you can kill those brutes, the better. They don't have shield generators, but take them out before... It's berserking! No! has infiltrated the council chamber? Protect the hierarchs! Seal the exits! Oh, I don't think so. down on one of the pedestals near the door. That prophet, Truth, he has the index. You've got to take it from him. Let me get these doors. Go, it'll be easier to track Truth if I stay in the network. <laughs> Right this way. Come <laughs> on. 
tower. I'll reverse this grab lift. Drop down, try to cut him off. It's safe, really. Just step in. position. Jump in! There are two groups of Marines in this detention block. I'll zero their locations. You neutralize the guards. Quietly.
Listen up, Marines. The Chief's hunting a prophet, and you're gonna help him kill it. Affirmative. One more group of Marines to go, Chief. All of the Marines, Chief. Good work. My brothers, the sacred icon is secure. It was Tartarus and his roots who from the flood. For that they have. Excellent. Truth is broadcasting on the move. It'll make him much easier to track. It was Tartarus and his roots who from the flood. For that they have our faith. Broadcasting on the moon, it'll make it much easier to track. Ah, oh, freeze them!
just destroyed two of their own ships, and I'm hearing reports of small arms fire throughout their fleet. Creatures of the cavern, and we shall walk it Slip space rupture. Side. It's in amber clad. said this day would never come. What are they to say now? Truth I have listened to the tower, There's an exit nearby. Hurry. Find out he was a Great journey begins with him. The elites are falling back to the mausoleum. <laughs> you wouldn't Who believe the number of kill systems the Covenant are throwing what down around. What have we foretold that has not Not to worry, it's pretty sloppy stuff. I guess they never expected a hostile intelligence to penetrate their network from the inside.
I'm picking up two more transponders. It's the Commander and Johnson. They're closing on two position, Chief. They'll need your help. Clad's wreckage. Let's get the index and find a way out of here before things get really ugly. Split them up. One in each phantom. The hopes of all the Covenant rest on your shoulders, Chieftain. My faith is strong. I will not fail. Let him be. The great journey waits for no one, brother. Not even you.
I'm starting to fear that you're not very smart. Mind your tongue, Oracle. Oh, I mean no offense. I'm not talking about you. I'm talking about your species. How long have these prophets been anointing Arbiters? Since the fall of Falchavami, the first disgraced Arbiter, roughly 400 years ago. Incredible! And in all this time, it never occurred to you how convenient it was that your prophets were able to find a powerful, capable leader among your people, who happened to suddenly commit a terrible blasphemy every time the power structure of your covenant was threatened. I do not understand. Hmm, you do little to dissuade my fears. Then teach me. Looking back at the record of the Arbiters you discussed, was it not surprising to anyone that those chosen to become Arbiter were more than simple warriors? How so? Each of them had significant political influence among your people. In some cases, that influence was already being used to question the decisions of your hierarchs. In fact, that very questioning often gave rise to the charges of heresy that so neatly removed the challenger from the hierarch's concern. And once they were branded Arbiter... They promptly and quite cheerfully ran to meet their deaths. All our lives we look down at the path, put our feet where the prophets tell us. All our lives spent convincing ourselves of the truth of our covenant. Could all of it truly have been wasted? Let's hope not all of it, for we have a great deal of work to do. The Flood is still out there, so I require a cooperative reclaimer to enact proper containment procedures. But your Covenant keep trying to kill all the reclaimers I can find. All this bickering is quite a deadly waste of time. Right now, the most important question we can ask is this. Who could break this hold the Prophets have over you?
the rings, Harbiter. The counselors, are they murdered by the brutes? Fire on these loyal beasts. The prophets were fools to trust them. in the center of the city, it's a forerunner ship. And Truth is heading straight for it if he leads the Covenant fleet to Earth. They won't stand a chance. You have to stop him. That brute has the Index. And Miranda and Johnson. He can activate the ring. If he does, I'll detonate in Amberclad's reactor just like we did the Autumns. The blast will destroy this city and the ring. It's not a very original plan, but we know it'll work. No, I don't want to chance a remote detonation. I need to stay here. Blood controlled drop ships are touching down all over the city. That creature beneath the library, that grave mind, used us. We were just a diversion. An amber clad was always its intended vector. There's a conduit connecting this tower to the ship. Head back inside. I'll lead you to it.
I'll disable this lift once you reach the top. That'll slow them down. I hope. Shall we let the Flood consume our holy city? Turn High Charity into another of their wretched hives. No enemy has ever withstood our might. The Flood too shall fail. I'll do what I can to slow the launch sequence. But there's something inside the ship, a presence that's fighting back. For a Covenant construct, it's unusually formidable. did not defeat the fall, and it shall not defeat us.
Parasite did not defeat the Forerunners. And it shall not defeat us. Arrogant creature. Your deaths will be instantaneous. While we shall suffer the progress of an infinitude. Whosoever is gripped by fear, take heed. Then I have to prove that I am not afraid. Noble mercy is here, on my side. With wise counsel, never in my ears. We exist together now. Two corpses in one grave. Covenant was good at repurposing Forerunner technology, but this is amazing. They've been using the Forerunner ship's engines as an energy source for the city. The ship isn't so much launching as it is disengaging, uncoupling itself from High Charity's power grid. Stopping truth, that's all that matters. Now is the time of our unworldliness. Moments we shall all become. Let's go on. You know the plan. You've got to stop truth. I've got to handle the index. Chief, when you get
get to Earth, good luck. After I'm through with Truth. Now make a girl a promise. If you know you can't keep it. What is that place? Where the counselors were meant to watch the consecration of the Icon. The start of the great journey. There is still time to stop the key from turning. I must get inside. Then mount up, Arbiter. I know a way to break those doors.
aid, Arbiter, and we'll fight by our side. Like you, but if we don't do something, Mr. Mohawk's gonna activate his ring, and we're all gonna die. Tartarus has locked himself inside the control room. Well, I just happen to have a key. Come on, grab a banshee and give me some cover. Gonna know what's coming.
Let's let the Arbiter into the chamber. The Chieftain must complete his holy work. from its socket! Mm. Which is nothing compared to what I'll do to you. Tartarus, stop! Mm. Impossible! Put down the icon. Put it down, and disobey the Hierarchs? There are things about Halo even the Hierarchs do not understand. Take care, Arbiter. What you say is heresy. Is it? Oracle. What is Halo's purpose? Collective no! the seven. Not another word! Please. Don't shake the light bulb. If you want to keep your brain inside your head, I tell those boys to chill. Go ahead. Do your thing. The sacred rings, what are they? Weapons of last resort, built by the Forerunners to eliminate potential flood hosts, thereby rendering the parasite harmless. And those who made the rings? What happened to the Forerunners? After exhausting every other strategic option, my creators activated the rings. They and all additional sentient life in three radii of the Galactic Center died as planned. Would you like to see the relevant data? Tartarus, the Prophets have betrayed us. <laughs> no, Arbiter! journey has begun, and the brutes, not the elite, shall be the prophet's escort.
What's that? A beacon. What's it doing? Communicating at superluminal speeds with the frequency Communicating of... with what? The other installations. Show me. Failsafe protocol. In the event of unexpected shutdown, the entire system will move to standby status. All remaining platforms are now ready for remote activation. Remote activation? From here? Don't be ridiculous. Listen, Tinkerbell, don't make me... Then where? Where would someone go to activate the other rings? Why the Ark, of course. And where, Oracle, is that? We've got a new contact. Unknown classification. It isn't one of ours. Take it out. This is Spartan 117. Anyone hear me? Over. Isolate that signal. Master Chief? You mind telling me what you're doing on that ship? Sir, finishing this fight. Thank you. 